hey tst gang in this video i'll be showing you my trekking adventures so stay tuned don't forget to like comment and subscribe So my truck broke down. I'm not sure what's wrong with it, but it turns off in the middle of me driving and it happened to me several times on the freeway. When your truck breaks down, your company might put you in a nice hotel like this one or they might put you in a raggedy hotel. It all depends on what you want because you got to set the tone. Never settle for less. Now I am on my way to Baltimore. Of course, you know it's a struggle putting my suitcase inside the truck because my suitcase is very heavy. I don't know what's in there, it's, it's just heavy. My whole life is inside this suitcase. So right now, I'm backing into the dock. Some shippers and receivers might ask you to back up to the dock and drop your trailer so they can load you. Can you make me 
put on these long sleeves because I don't have a long sleeve shirt. And in order for me to get loaded, I have to put on these before I can get loaded. So that's why I'm putting this on. So right now I'm in a restaurant in Nashville, Tennessee. I'm currently eating some seafood. Every now and then you can take your 18-wheeler and park it in a big parking lot that has truck parking. And as long as you're buying food, it's okay for you to park. It's no big deal. You're not subject to eat truck stop food. So right now I found a super center Walmart and I asked the manager if I can park my truck there. Most of the time they do say yes. Sometimes they're not too leery of letting truckers park overnight. But anyways, I went and I shopped and I got some food and I'm gonna hit the road and it's always better to cook food in your truck as opposed to buying food at restaurants and eating at the truck stop. So now I'm getting in the truck, I'm putting the groceries inside the truck, then I'm gonna head over to Target to get a refrigerator. As you can see, I'm struggling to put the refrigerator into the cart because the cart keeps on moving every time I lift the refrigerator up. But after a few attempts, I did get the refrigerator into the cart. Thank you all for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.
Thank you.